Hey YouTube, this is Glint Gamers. I'm Ryan, this is Kayla, and uh, today we're going to be playing Wild Silver. Yeah. Oh, cool. Got some awesome dragons that attracted me. Ah, uh, is, that, is that the draw here? Perhaps. I see. Perhaps. I see where this came from. Alright, well, let's see. Let's see how cool these dragons are. Ah. Uh. Forests. Alright. There's a chest over there. Yes. Letting us know about all the controls. Alright. Got some orb thing. It's kind of like a uh, potion. Ambiance. Ambiance. You yeah. gained experience for opening a chest, apparently. A magic a mirror. point or something? Oh. Oh, okay. It's like fast travel. Alright, I was expecting to like jump in and get a little bit of story or something. I wasn't expecting to get right into the gameplay. Welcome oh, to the Wild Silver Prototype. This version of the game contains most battle mechanics, but no puzzle mechanics, no plot, and no quests. Okay. You will only visit a few of the locations planned for the final game where they may also look different. You may find the music is pretty cool. I do. That's just placeholder music too. Hopefully you'll like the actual pieces even better. The main purpose of this version is to test the battle system. When I want to find out the skills, items, equipment, enemies, and status effects are actually fun. Therefore, it's very important that you try out all the skills you learn and all the items you get. Please write down your feedback and send it to this email. <laughs> 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 I didn't feel like reading the whole thing. Clever. Alright. Let's make this an awesome game. Cool. Alright, let's see. See these battles, shall we? Right. Uh, so I'm assuming these, like, gray, uh, brown paths are new areas? Yeah. yeah. Dash, I see. Square it should be. Yeah, there you go. Alright. No battles yet. Oh. Uh, there we go. Just an action for a turn and defeat the enemies. Okay. Velvin. Attack skills guard. The little Got claws. Eighth for attacking. Did you see the little claw? I did see the little claw. She has some like passive ability when she attacks, she gains haste or something. Mm hmm. I have to interact with the chest from the front, I see. Okay, those are like orbs. experience orbs, I get it. That's why you got experience before. Got a touch. Save your progress. Alright. Okay. Nice. There's another one hiding behind that tree over there. Yeah, there is. Yeah. Oh. A worm. Access the party menu. Yeah. What skills do we have? Leap. Okay, it does more damage if the enemy has full HP. Hmm. Okay. Ah, it has a cooldown. Mm -hmm. Alright. Look at that little Drop mushroom. mushroom. Alright. Mm. can tell they definitely used a lot of scripting in this game. Oh yeah. It's not just raw RPG Maker. Unless RPG Maker's changed a lot since I've last <laughs> messed with it, but... So I guess use their skill, right? Oh, interesting. Also, apparently the items have a limited amount of use per battles, so you can't just spam your items over and over again. Oh, yeah, that was another thing we were reading about. Yeah. At least that's what I read from the potion itself that you were looking at. Yeah. Alright. A lot of cool... UI effects going on here. Yeah. It's kind of good that they did that with the items because I can definitely remember from Pokemon being a very, very, very famous example of that. Especially like if you're the Elite Bam. Four. Yeah, at least against yeah PC enemies. Oh yeah. Yep. Just fighting those <laughs> full restore bosses over and over again, right? That's right. Or even doing it to yourself. Yes, yeah, that's also kind of Defeats the challenge, right? Right. Or, 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 or. 
Hey, look at this guy. Hi, he's a shop. He is a shop. Alright, what's he got for us? Sell your potions. Hey, you wanna see what he sells? Doesn't sell anything. I don't Doesn't think. sell anything. Alright, hit buy. Oh, never mind. There you go. Okay, just potions and herbs. Yeah. What the herbs do? Remove all negative stat effects, okay. Sure. Burr, burr, burr. Level one worm. Or level five worm. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, ouch. It's like an abstract tapeworm aesthetic going on. Kind of. Oh, jeez. Uh. Did it kill itself? Did it? Apparently. It's dead now. You might want to heal. You got like, what, 10 HP? Oh no, I guess leveling up fully heals you. Okay. Fair enough. Didn't want that chest over there. Oh, I do. Critical. Ah, there we go, crit. Wonder if they give you other party members in the demo at all. Guess we'll find out. Okay, yes. Something about the sprite aesthetic in this game reminds me a little bit of Lunar. Definitely Lunar. not the battle system, but... The aesthetic does. Mm. Perhaps they were inspired by it. Could be. Undine's Weave. Mm. Change your equipment in the menu. Alright, so what does that equipment do for you? Cloth, Kitty waist claws and cloth, waist cloth. Okay. Huh. Mm -hmm. So that has an effect too. Has wind damage and aether damage taken, so it's a new one too. Raises max HP by 25% and prevents poison. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty good. Hmm. I wonder what's making you do that haste thing then. Could be a passive thing that she has. Yeah, check, check her status. I'm curious if she has like passive skills or something. Uh, gains haste dex plus 50% when she attacks. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah so it is a passive. Interesting. That's pretty neat. Yeah. Definitely another thing I don't recall RPG Maker having previously was passive abilities. I want that little orb. Chest, rather. Potion. Alright. Nice. Healy statue. Uh, what does that do? Look at that. Mysterious spell rock is spell floating rock. above the ground. Classy name. Mm -hmm. Ah, you can learn a spell. Uh, oh, a specific character though. Mm. So maybe not her. Chests over there on the list. Alright. Blue crystal. And... Ocean. Do you yeah. like the Katie dids in the background? I do like the Katie dids. I do too. It adds some uh, nature to this game. Nature aesthetic. Love the ambiance. Oh, you leveled up. Nice. Okay. Oh, look at that. QB fellow over there, the classy QB. Wonder if he's a party member. Okay. And Drake. I I really like how the enemies like drop the items mm -hmm. when they die. It's kind of satisfying. Yeah. Yes. That orb thought it could hide from us. There's another one down yeah, below, there's too. another one trying to hide from us. Oof. Yeah, it does hurt itself when it does a ram attack. Hmm. Huh. Clog. Hmm. Oof. Ouch. Ooh. Ooh. Really feeling it here. Yeah. 
If you kill the worm, you should be safe. The other guy does, like, no damage. There you go. Use your skill. It's true. Does more damage when they're at full HP. Crit. I do also like that it does show their HP bar so you can plan effectively. Oh yeah. It's definitely nice. Mr. QB guy up here. I'm Bargo the Hunter. I would normally give you quests where you kill monsters and get rewards. But this is only the Wild Silver mm -hmm. prototype, so I'll reward you simply for playing at all. Attack the candy. candy. So I, assume that, I, would, I assume they raise your stats permanently. Had you completed all my hunts in this area, I would have given you this as well, which you shall also receive just so. Heart. Okay. Mm -hmm. what, what do all those do? Yeah, those I figured. Those they're permanent. Here's the damage to. Okay, I like that it tells you what the stats do too. Mm-hmm. It's like here's the damage dealt with attacks. Yeah, that's pretty standard. Defense lowers. Hmm. Yeah, so spells physical, and then like Dex was explaining. Oh yeah, your gauge moves faster. I'm just gonna get them older. her. Yep, might as well. For now, she's all we got. That we're aware of, anyway. Yep. Potion. Game just handed those potions out like candy. Literally. Yeah. Literally. Oh, I wish they were handing the candy out like candy. Jelly. Jelly. It's dead now. Ooh. Kitty claws. Pretty cute. Yeah, I like that they have kind of like a injured animation too. Mm -hmm. Ah, they dropped an item. Fairy dust. What's fairy dust do? Collectible. There it is. Give these to fairies and receive passives of your choice. Ah, mm. interesting. The wear except I could sell that. Sell this. Sell that. Blue crystal. Give these to. What was that? Jeweler? For something? No, the blue crystal. And receive blessings. Mm. Ah, I see. I guess we'll see what that does. This is a gold chest. There's gotta be something fancy in there, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe a new weapon? Maybe your party members in the chest. <laughs> <laughs> they just stuffed them in there. That'd be funny if you were correct. <laughs> and you never oh, know. Frit. Ah, excellent. Rusty something coin, I think. Probably something you saw. Locked. What? Ah. We gotta get a key. All right. Well, where's that key? We gotta let our party member out of there. Mandrake. It's all dancy. Cry. It's crying. It's quite the. Uh... Oh, you can't use your attack action. I have to guard. Yeah, I have to guard. Huh. It's pretty crazy. Two turns. Ah. Alright, there you go. Well, at least this time you have your leap, right? There you go. Oh. Not a lot of damage, though. And Drake's. Oh, did got she a little damage herself? I think so. Did, do you also have a passive that makes the enemies damage themselves? This, this is obnoxious. What an obnoxious enemy. Can leap her this time. Healing herself too. Oh, she's healing herself. Okay, well, at least she's dead. Ooh. Yeah. Be a rough enemy. Wonderful. Encounter more coons to sell these mushrooms too. That'd be nice. Oh, there's a. Oh, it looks like a boss over there. What do we got here? Potion. Lots of potions. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is the last healer before the boss. Looks like a big tree. Tree enemy. It's got 
Got Cherubimon here. Powerful enemy awaits ahead. Should be level, level five. five. We are level there. five, so perfect. Guard has damage taken for four turns. Oh, interesting. So it's not just the turn that you guard. Hmm. It's actually useful. Seventeen damage. I'm, I'm a little underwhelmed with this leap. Is, uh, cherry mon. Yep. It's cherry mon. Oh. Maybe guard, like it said, because it lasts for four turns. It said. Yeah. Oof. Mhm. Mm That's obnoxious. Treant. Oh, I think your crit broke his guard. I think you're right. Hmm. Uh. Right. Nice. There we go. That's fifty percent. Oh, bosses have different patterns. Interesting. All right. So far, I'm pretty impressed. It's there. The crits are pretty satisfying too. Yeah, you get that sound effect and, and the, the big shake. like critical. Look at the thrash marks. Yeah, he's angry. Not pleased with you. Oof. All the slow. I right, dropped the heart. Huh. Look at him as he like just melts into the ground. Yeah, just satisfyingly dies like that, right? Yeah. A radiant heart. What's with that? <laughs> Is it a brave heart? Uh, maybe. See how brave that heart is. Potion. Extra, Extra life. life. Whoa, what? I assume that just like auto revives you when you die. Only raises max HP by 40. Okay, so I assume that's just a higher amount than the regular heart was. It's extra life. There's a hero with 25% uh, okay. HP limit in Battle 5. Okay. Not super exciting or anything, just a revive item. Oh, uh, yes, good call. <laughs> Very good call. Alright, alright. Ah, village. Nice. Wasn't expecting this in this demo. Hello, I am a famous storyteller. Do you want to hear a story? Once upon a time, there was a girl on a quest to save her sister who was very sick. Only the legendary elixir would cure the strange affliction she was suffering from. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, I cannot remember how the story continued. Please come back later. I love how she's like, um, how did it continue? <laughs> I'm assuming that's probably what the actual story of the game is going to be. Right. You can get boosters, hearts, and candies from the fountain if you throw some coins into it. Oh, is that what we use the rust rusty coin for? There are 30 left. Let's toss those coins in there. Okay. Excellent. I think that's pretty cool. Heart. Do I have any more? I thought we got, like, one more rusty coin. No? Oh, okay. What does this guy want? I've got to tell you that another hero and a number of special enemies are not included in this prototype either. Please look forward to encountering them in the final game. Like a, what, a blacksmith here or something right there? And like an item shop. And... No, it's the, uh, it's the blacksmith all about up there. Talk to her first, okay, and then we'll okay. share. Find out. Arthiel. I'm looking for a tome that's supposed to be hidden in the deep caves. It's a heavy tome with a pink cover and elven runes in it. It's quite old and holds magical powers. Don't worry, it's nothing dangerous. If you find it, would you bring it to me? A tome, huh? I'll keep my eyes open. Thank you. Alright. Got a quest there. Teleport back to our first mirror if we want. I did notice there was a a left path back mm -hmm. by the first mirror. 
Oh, interesting. Yeah. Fast travel thing. Save point. Okay. Blacksmith, huh? Yep. There's like a white crystal down there. I wonder if that's like the passive one. That's the fairy one. Alright, what's this guy all about? Forge. Greetings, Greetings. I'm the blacksmith of this village. I can upgrade a silver sword with silver ores. Mm. But you don't have a silver sword. Oh, what a tragedy. <laughs> Guess what? Oh, he has stairs there. Can you go down his stairs? He's hiding a chest in his basement or something. Good catch. Yeah. Oh, she's uh, surprised. She's a goodie. That's, that's unfortunate. What kind of RPG protagonist are you? <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, this isn't a coon. I just realized I'm <laughs> leaving the mouse right in front of the whole whole screen. Oh. Gone now. <clears throat> Welcome to my little shop. Have you seen anything of interest? Ah. Ah, here we got more claws for... Our main character here. A cat claws. Attack by partedly. So I see. Oh, it always removes guard when you attack mm -hmm. with your claws. I see. Jaguar claws. All right. Tiger claws. Need a lot of uh, hmm. amber, whatever the heck that is. Mm -hmm. Removes armor. Has melee and projectile damage taken. Huh. Hmm. Some other party member we don't have. Bows, attacks from a distance, always hits floating enemies. Can't be countered, but can be reflected. Huh. Mm. And those are the... Mm. Okay, so anything with the green does that. Beta shell. Mm. Plates. Silly goggles. Double experience gained. <laughs> Please don't buy. <laughs> Is that the only accessories he's got? I love that demo accessory for those who absolutely hate grinding. Please don't buy. Buy the bread. Was there bread? I didn't see bread. Buy the bread? Yeah. There's I didn't no see bread, bread here. Unless something was called bread. I don't think so. Nah. Yeah. Being trolled here by our chat. Things. Oh, it's on the table, I see. I can sell these rare caps. Mushrooms. Oh boy. Did you Fable see all that money? Cap. 10. 20, 20 Hold. amber Was things. it 20? I thought it was 10. No. Oh, oh it was man. 10 for a single one. Ah, I see. Alright, well, what's the fabled one? How much do we get for that one? 25. Ooh. Oh, we're rolling in it. We're not rolling in it, we're poor. Uh. Alright. Nope. Oh. Did he say thanks you? 